Axonometric Projection 5. Given the elevation, the plan, and the 3D graphic of the solid, you're asked to draw the isometric view using axonometric projection. First thing to do is to project in the points from the elevation. Bring all the points down. And that includes the six points on the circle. Now, the points on the circle, we've divided the circle into six equal parts and numbered them one, two, three, four, five, and six. Using this piece of paper, I've marked the points on the paper and transfer those points down to the plan and mark them along and number them. And now we draw vertically up from the points in the plan. So we're looking for the top of this piece here. That's it there and that's it in plan. So we bring the four points up from the plan And now trace the points fr from the plan and elevation in to get the isometric view of each point. So that's three points and that's four points. Now we line in those four points. And that's the top of that little piece there. That's that piece there. Now we're looking for this top of this next piece, this wee blue piece here, and that's it in the elevation. So project those four points up. And now trace the points. That's point one, that's two, that's three, and the last one there is four. Now line in that piece. And that's the isometric of the top of that. Now the circle here is going to be in this position. So bring up the points from the plan. One, two, three, four, five. And now trace them in from the elevation and the plan and indicate each point as you find it. And now freehand curve through those points. That's the isometric of the circle. To get the back curve, we bring up the back points. So that's one, two, three, four, and five at the back. Now trace the back ones up and mark each point in the isometric here and line in those points. And that's your back curve done. Now, the front of the top piece. So bring in the points from the elevation and up from the plan and that gets you the four points now of the end of that top piece. So now we can join these two points for the slope. That's that done. That's the top piece almost done. Just line in the bottom line there and the end and that's the top piece complete. Now to get the bottom piece, bring the points up from the plan again and trace from the elevation down and the plan up and that gets you those four points for the front of that bottom piece. And now find that point there and get this slope, that's the slope, join the points down and that's the drawing complete. Line it in and a little bit of colour added to it. And that's axonometric projection 5 complete.